This is how to side volley by the modern day goalkeeper. These are five key areas to the side volley. One, the stance. Two, the throw. Three, the support leg. Four, the connection. And five, the follow through. Uh, the first step is the stance or the body position, the starting body position. Uh, you want to have your shoulder facing your target and the ball in the opposite hand to your kicking foot. The next step is the throw or what we like to call it a release. So you start the ball around hip height and don't release till around shoulder height. So you more, it's, it is a throw but it's more of a drop, drop throw uh, rather than a throw into the air. The next step is the support leg or the planting foot. You want to externally rotate your standing foot, your planting foot, so you get more rotation, which gives you more power. The next step is the connection. Try to hit the ball just below centre, trying to get a little bit of a backspin to give the, the true flight. You want to strike the ball with the laces, part of your boot, which is obviously the strongest part of your foot and gives you the most power. The last of the steps is the, the follow through. You're hitting down on the ball and you're bringing your foot to the ground as soon as possible after you've connected with the ball. A few other little tips. Um, try not to rush. Rushing is one of the biggest parts of why you might uh, scuff your side volley or kick it into the ground, which obviously you don't want to do it. Don't try to hit the ball too hard. Um, it's all about timing and technique and not massive amount of power. Obviously the little snap movement, the faster you do that, the more power you're going to get, but don't try to, don't try to smash the ball too hard. Practice is the key. Have a look, do slow motion on, on your phone or on a camera, see where you're going wrong and practice, practice and that's the only way you'll, you'll know how you're going wrong and the ways to improve.